Here's DaVinci Resolve version 17, let's see how to control the audio volume using keyframes. So first of all let's increase the size of that audio track so that we can see this white line. So hold down the ALT key and simply left click and there's a keyframe. So ALT and left click, ALT and left click, ALT and left click. Okay, now between those points you can track them and you can increase the volume or decrease the volume. You can move the point also, click on that point, and you can increase or decrease the volume. Okay, now let's use the inspector and go to the audio part. And here at volume, since we have these keyframes, we can move that uh, playhead to those keyframes because otherwise this volume is not changing the volume where we want, but it's changing at the beginning of the clip. So undo Ctrl Z. So use the volume and move to the right to the next keyframe on the right side. Next, next, next. And there you can move that volume in that point. So you must be on exactly on the keyframe and then you can type in a value that you want. Okay, to move the keyframe exactly on horizontal first hold on the shift key and then start moving it to the left and right now it's not moving up and down but oops so hold on shift key and of course it's doing it up and down also so the first movement is taken in consideration so start moving it to the right eh, not working so shift and to the right now it's working okay and how to delete multiple keyframes because if you simply drag with this arrow it's not selecting the keyframes but the two tracks so since we have keyframes we have this black curvy line here and by opening that one we have the same keyframes that are up here they are down there also and down there you can really select them let's say only those two and delete or if I press ctrl A it will delete all the keyframes so this one since doesn't since it doesn't have keyframes it doesn't show that line okay that's it thanks for watching and yeah, bye bye